they try to make you believe when you come out here and do these shows that your career going to take off and shit. Like, like everybody in here is somebody. Like white lady, what you do for a living? You live in Brooklyn for a living? What do you do for a living? You're a project manager. How is she gonna help my career? I don't understand. Like, she doesn't know any producers or anything. You got a Jewish last name? <laughs> Fuck, I'm mean, it's over with. This is just another show. And that's the thing, like, I got a question for y'all. Like, I don't understand how y'all live with the, the L.A. rigmarole. Like, for example, if you a parent, make some noise. Yeah. Do y'all keep it real with your kids? Yeah. Make some noise if your kids got a cell phone. Well, let's see how real y'all keep it. I'm gonna let y'all know something. If your child has a cell phone, just know they have seen some fucking. <laughs> Hate to be the bear bad news, but they done seen some, I'm talking about penetration fucking, for real. Like, think about it, and that's the thing, man. I got an 11-year-old daughter, right? And she just got caught watching porn on her phone. True story. Oh. Fuck y'all. <laughs> see, that's what's wrong with people. Y'all forget how fucked up y'all was as kids. I didn't, I know how horrible of a person I was at 11 years old. Nothing that little girl can do can shock me. Her mother all tripping. Oh my God, she was watching porn on her phone and my bad mother. I'm like, first of all, that is your daughter, okay? This is what you gotta understand. The night we met, we was 18 and we had unprotected sex. That's in her. If you don't curve that now, she's gonna have a problem when she get old. So she like, well, just go talk to her. And then one thing about me and my daughter, I train my daughter that she has to talk to me about everything. I don't care what it is you do, I'm with you right or wrong. But you gotta let me know what you do so we can handle it. So I go in the room and I'm like, look, you know what time it is, baby? She said, yeah, daddy. I said, you been watching porn on your phone? She was like, yeah. I said, let me see the phone. Oh, baby, you gotta go to a better site than this. This ain't even a good one. You wasting data on this motherfucker. You gotta go, I ain't never even heard of this one before. You gotta go to Tasty Blacks. That's the good one. Better meet some little boy in school. You think I'm gonna let some little nigga in school introduce her to the cool porn and now she in love with this nigga? Nope, it's daddy. I taught you about the good shit. Maybe I'm crazy, I don't understand. And that's the thing, most of y'all act like you don't remember how fucked up you was as a young person. If I had the internet when I was 11 years old, I would have been a single father already, guaranteed. Ain't no way, like you got access to every single person that's in your vicinity. When I was in school and a young man, the only girls I knew was the ones that went to school with me and lived in my community. Now you know what the girls look like all across the city.